Drew Blaylock. Uh, what the hell is he doing here? I don't know, man. Drew, buddy. Ladies, you three are looking good tonight. So, you ladies are headed to a house party? What kind of house party is it? Uh, it's just a, a housewarming party. Yeah, more of a small get together, really. Um, we should probably go. You know what? Why don't you give me the address and uh, I'll meet you over there. Uh, yeah. No. What the hell? Damn lesbo. Please call me Bob. You and I are friends after all. I'm in charge here. And later on, I'll be in charge over at your place. Well, dinner was good. <laughs> Are you ready for dessert? Doctor, do you think this will work? Roy, I have to be honest with you. Nothing is 100% guaranteed, but the testing from this particular hearing aid has been promising. Look, we just don't want this to be another disappointment for a daughter. We don't want that role. Farah, do you know what this means? I mean, you'll be able to watch TV, you know, play with your friends without having to look at their mouths all the time. We've been through this before. Look, I love you. I do. But you're going to have to take your condition seriously, sweetheart. Look, I'm going to be in the study getting some work done. Here's a book that you ordered. Well, it looks pretty interesting. Fine. I'll take my very interesting book on the porch. Maybe I'll get some play then. You simply can't do all these things, Lauren. Why do you put yourself through this? You have everything you need right here in your palace. Joseph! Um, no. There is no party for us to go to. You're in no shape to go to any party, and you know that. Plus, no wife of mine will ever wear that. Look, she's not going anywhere. Get some I'll deal with you inside. I'm so sorry. Didn't make that plane. Joseph, man, no. Okay? Her heart was weak, and you know that. Okay, but if I forgot my phone or. Ooh, stop talking. I bet he is well connected. Call me. Oh, no, really, call me.